on the YouTube dog show. It was with up, it was Ellie Hugo, and now, because it's Halloween, even though it's Halloween, this guy is still not so frightening. Ellie Cuggy Hugo! Welcome to Wicked Talk, I'm Ellie Cuggy Hugo, what's up, my friend? Alright, besides, besides Shout Pack, when I talk about both the fan heads, things like that, USA underscore MO, which is like, Gameplays and whatnot, companies, which is World V, and of course, Red Pick, which is our screen world. Though we're not really sure if he's still, uh, around or not. But anyway, good to have you here, folks, and happy Halloween! Happy Halloween! Yes! Great like show! And I'm going over. Tonight, we're talking about Halloween. Well, all right on Halloween night! And we haven't been ghosted yet. Pretty cool, huh? Isn't this cool, Adam? Halloween night and we haven't been ghosted yet. Now, there are a couple of news items that we'll probably not see. A new, a new study says that millennials spend billions of dollars on Halloween stuff every year or the shot on social media. Well... I don't know how, uh, I don't know how to tell you this, but social media can really make Halloween ripple. Yeah. How? Well, because, uh, now, because of social media, instead of actually going door to door, uh, trick or treating, they're actually doing the virtual trick or treating. What the fuck is a virtual trick or treat? That makes no sense. Okay, but. Listen to this, right? Me, dogs are in love with Halloween. Dogs love Halloween. They always dress up to the nines on Halloween. Dogs can't dress themselves up. How? We have their fake poles, poles, poles and stuff. They don't even have them. They have balls. How? Are they just putting, like, random mud and random juices on themselves? Or just... Are they rolling their heads in dye? In purple dye? Huh? No. I don't think so, Chief. How does a dog dress up for Halloween? How? Uh, the owners dress them up, but they love treats. I mean, you see a human being dressed up as a beer can? No! That's security dog. Well, I've seen a dog dressed up uh, as a beer can. Well, it's time for tonight's top eight list. Now, usually uh, on Thursdays, uh, the Pink Cat Awards are going up, but we couldn't find uh, the Pink Cat, so instead, we have a new cat to, de to debut the Blue Munch. So, here we go with tonight's top eight list, and here we go.
sisters Nick at night Classic as you can get All night Every night If your home is haunted by old carpeting, don't be afraid. Empire is having a monster carpet sale with savings to die for. <laughs> Save 50% off all the latest styles and colors. We'll bring samples to your home and install next day with no payments till 2003. Save 50% on Empire's monster carpet sale. It's a sale you can sink your teeth into. <laughs> to 300 Let's talk about it. Just shit. 
It's your shit. Do whatever you want. It's Halloween. You can show off your costume. I mean, that's the only reason that you buy one is to show is to show show it off. But what's the big deal? Showing it off uh, outside. I mean, uh, on uh, the social of the media. What's so bad? Nothing is bad. Nothing is nothing is wrong here. Okay. Now, listen to this uh, right here, okay? I don't agree with this. This is a cop dressing up his dog. But the old dog does not want to look like no Mary Poppins. He does not want to like that, that, this, or that. He'll allow himself to be dressed up, but you better feed him extra treats. You better give him extra play, because if not, he is going to punch in your eyeball out. But listen to this, right? Dogs love treats. But here like are the, but here are but here are some of the Halloween uh, looks that are twat that are being spotted all over uh, the United States or something like that. Let's uh, look at this, right? You know we you may not have a lasso of twelve. No no she's uh, apparently trying to be Wonder Woman. But it's pretty good. Wouldn't you agree? Okay, now, this is what I was talking uh, to you about earlier. Look at this. Shotzi. Dressed up as a beer can. The owner seems like a fun guy. Let's do that. But I mean, guys, don't dress up your beer, beer dog. The dog is just going to try to fight you. This is like I don't I don't, I don't want your guy to be very nice to your to your dog because he's he's gonna wanna slap you. He's gonna wanna bite your freaking nose off. And of course that. there's Harry the UPS dog. But you know what Adam mm -hmm. Do you have uh, a scary story to tell? Remember when we used to tell scary stories from Halloween on this show? I think we should uh, do that again. Uh, let's make. I think I got one. Grab the other flashlight and let's do it. I don't really know what I got. Let's see. I'll just use my mic. You will take a lot. Alright, folks. Giddy up. Hey. <laughs> the lighting is so much better in the dark than it is in the actual lighting. <laughs> okay, catch around. It's time for uh, it's time for the right Halloween. One Halloween. The right Halloween. Watch this. One Halloween. It was snowing. That's right. Pitter patters of snow. It snowed so much that it turned into a blizzard. That blizzard was so bad that made. Elephants and owls work together for the common cause of getting candy. So one day, it went into a cow's uh, candy basket and put a hole in the basket. Okay. The candy fell out, and the elephant, the owl, ate all the candy. The kid went home and said, what happened to the candy? As it turns out, the elephant and the owl we're actually working with Dracula. Shut, shut up. Alright, so, so guys, I'm tired, so I'm gonna give y'all the most bootleg sto story. So once upon a time, this man was saying, Now, they, they, they have that, that, that made friend, but, but his, but his mother was a voodoo priest, right? Right. So, and and stole her his his mother's secret voodoo doll. But then a spooky ghost called <coughs> came up to <coughs> and began to, to slap him, right? Right. But then that's when his mother came in and was like, You fool! You fall my trap card and banished them both! But she didn't know that she banished her son! So guess who came in there? Ooh. 
the police came in because fool you was playing in village, right? Right. And then she, and then she got arrested, but then the but then the chief police came in and said no, the law said that he can't do fool you then, and so he got arrested. So he got arrested. The police got arrested. The the, the chief was given a medal of honor by the president of village and now is in the thing right right he in the doll with the gold and they're and and, and they're fighting right right but then before the mother got uh uh, uh, uh arrested she gets oh she said ooh, ooh, ooga booga right right and then the magical gold the booga booga came out and destroyed the village Oi. I'm sorry, we did not plan that those toys at all. He just does you go toys out at random. Would you agree, Adam? Oh, you don't know about Oonga Boonga. The Oonga Boonga came from a festival, a festival village called. Now, what is that? Spooky village. The name was there was a ghost and skeleton. And so. Every night on Halloween, they'll go, Spooky, scary skeletons, the shivers out your spine. But then, when they sung the song, the zombies will come with, doing a church of trilogies. It was crazy. You did that while we back in Village Ends. What do you do that while we do the Booker Village? It was crazy. All right, well, I hope that your Halloween was uh, random and as crazy as this episode was. Well, now we're talking about Tom Hanks, but Nep, Up and I, now it's a sex group like the man who got people with that spot, like Ryan Jack, Michael Lake, Ass, and David Duck Station. You know, with uh, the uh, tech group, and, uh, and so many other surprises. That's right, it's, uh, it's a big Friday night show, so don't waste your time, uh, you know, sleeping and missing on uh, tomorrow night's show. That's the news. I'm out, Steve. Bye, 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 bye.